okay guys in this video tutorial we will learn that how we can resize an image within the MATLAB resizing simply means that we are going to decrease the size of the image and if we will decrease the size of an image the information stored or the data stored in it will be lost not all the data but up to how much we are going to resize it will always affects the data stored within the image first we will take a variable that is i am is equal to m read of peppers dot png m read is a built-in command of matlab which will read the peppers dot png file that is the image file and store all the information within the variable i am you can write any variable here like m i or i am or x y or anything now we will run it okay now you can see that we have read and stored our image within the i am so we will also show this image by using the command m show and also writing a delay function for this image show time m show is a built-in command or library function of the matlab and it will display any image within this parenthesis so run it and here we will got our image now write any other variable like b is equal to m m resize that image that is i am and comma 0.5 and now this 0.5 is actually our scale 0.5 means that half of the information will be lost and half of the size of the image will be reduced and how it is possible it simply means that every alternate line that is rows and columns will be raised by the m resize command then the size will reduce to half of the original image now we will write m show of b okay now we will run it now you can see that our image is there it is small in size and also lost some sort of data and through these blurring of blurred effect we can sense it one more thing that if you want to custom if you want the custom resizing of an image then write i am to square brackets right here 100 and 100 means that image must be reduced to 100 columns and 100 rows then m show of c now we will run it now you can see that now there are just 100 lines and 100 columns and a lot of information is also lost so hopefully you got the concept regarding the resizing of an 
image so thanks for watching